Good morning, Vikings. I'm Eduardo. And I'm Paloma. And welcome to another episode of Viking Vision. Attention Vikings, testing month has finally come. To all juniors taking the SBAC, SAT, and ACT, be sure to get in those last minute study sessions. Be sure the day before each test, or even the week before, get a good night's sleep and eat some good meals. Take every advantage possible to do your absolute best. Color Guard placed second in the Winter Guard Association of Southern California Championship in Class 1A. Way to go Vikings. Good job to our baseball team on beating Covina with a score of three to one. We would like to applaud Paul Vega for qualifying in the 100 backstroke. Track has been dominating the league with 10 of our athletes advancing to CIF prelims. We have several league champions, Lauren Gibson for the 100 and 200 meter, Anibal Lopez for discus, Mariah Ortega for shot put, and Ulysses Aparicio for long jump. Also winning a league championship is our girls 4x400 meter relay team, consisting of Lauren Gibson, Alyssa Magana, Kayla Vander Ebb, and Haley Vanetta. It's been a great month for our Vikings, and that's it for sports. As we look around the campus this year, we notice the changes to the front parking lot and the new track and football field. But there's one change that not everyone has noticed yet. Here's Edmund with the story. Northview has changed its logo many times over the years. As you can see, some are better than others. Wow, I'm sure that a lot of people are glad that this isn't at the head of our school anymore. So, how did we get this new logo? So there was a group of teachers, um, teacher leaders, coaches, um, students, leaders that were kind of weighing in on the, the process of this uh, questionnaire. The brand that we have now is fully licensed. It's 100% ours. We can use it whenever and wherever we want. We then interviewed some students on what they thought of our new logo. I just don't, it, I don't like the picture. It looks like something you find in Spongebob. It looks ridiculous. I just feel like it's too plain. It doesn't really represent us Vikings very well. I think it's cool. I think it's uh, not necessarily a downgrade from the end and the sword through it. One student who asked to remain anonymous says, I understand that administration has the final say, but since this is a place for students and teachers, shouldn't their opinions be considered? We conducted a survey of 170 students about which of these Northview logos they like best. 70% prefer the previous N logo, 2% like the Viking head, 22% like the new logo, 4% like the Viking ship from the 1970s, and two were just plain obstinate about all of them, and they didn't really care for either one. So, will the new logo grow on us? Maybe. Just like anything, it takes a little time to get used to. I'm Edmund Gonzalez, back to you. Thanks, Edmund. Love acting, plays, or drama in particular? Northeast Drama Program is holding their annual original scene festival. Let's take a look at what we should expect from our talented drama students. A two-day event written and directed by our very own Viking. What is this? Quiet, I'm still talking. $5 at the door, this is an event you don't want to miss. Only on May 29th and on May 30th, starting at 7 p.m. If you're looking for an interesting night full of fun and entertainment, be sure to go out and support them. This year's prom is quickly approaching. To showcase this magical night, here is more on the event. Got a date? Great! No date? No problem. With prom quickly approaching, here's some of our ASB members with an inside scoop on a night full of Hollywood glamour. This year's prom theme is a Hollywood affair, so it's like an old Hollywood vibe. Prom is at the city of Grove in Anaheim. Yeah, I mean, there's a whole bunch of little restaurants nearby, um, like Denny's, and I know that's like a Togo Sandwiches. Um, you can go eat before prom, you just can't go in and out of prom. Anything surprising that you can look out for is that things will be done a little bit differently at this prom. You'll just have to come to find out. A little party never killed nobody. So we gonna dance until we drop, drop, drop. Mm -hmm. A little party never killed nobody. Right here, right now is all we get. Hurry up and buy your tickets before they are all sold out. Remember, only juniors and seniors can purchase the tickets. The cost is $90 with ASB, 
and 95 without. And if you plan on bringing a guest that does not attend Northview, you must have them fill out a permission slip available in the attendance office. Guests must be under 21. Have a fun and safe night Vikings. Northview is known for its colorful and artistic students that express themselves through different forms of art. Here is more on the story. What defines art? Is it only in the harmonies of a musician? Or in the paint strokes of an artist? Here in Northview, art lies beyond the stereotypical boundaries and limitations. It comes in many forms. Art is magic. Art is creating. Art is expression. And like Northview, art is made up of colorful visions. So different and distinct. Yet beautiful. We are all artists. What is art to you? Thanks, girls. Keep on creating art, Vikings. It is now time for this week's Vines of the Week. Send us your requests on our Twitter and Instagram, or feel free to just show any member here on the show. And that, everyone, concludes today's episode. Don't forget to check us out on Twitter at Viking Vision and on Instagram at NHS Viking Vision. I'm Paloma. And I'm Eduardo. And this is Viking Vision. Signing, Signing off. off.